um, all of the different uh, countries involved uh, with all the different assets. Uh, we are in direct support of the Malaysian government, uh, the Malaysian people, and as uh, new leads are provided, uh, we're tasked accordingly. So uh, from an operational perspective, uh, we're just trying to put our best assets uh, on the task and clearly now that it's turned into this very wide area search, uh, that maritime patrol reconnaissance uh, capability is uh, able to cover just a lot of ground uh, in a short period of time. With so much Thanks. air assets and seaborne assets in the area, how long do you think you would be able to cover the assigned areas? Uh, so if, if everybody didn't hear the question, it was how long will we be able to cover the assigned areas? Uh, frankly, uh, we will continue uh, to cover uh, the areas with airborne assets because that's really what the problem set calls for now um, uh, for a, a good length of time. You know, we will uh, try to support uh, as long as we can. Uh, you know, uh, as well as I do, the 7th Fleet has a lot of operational commitments throughout a very wide theater, but we are zeroed in on this effort, and that's why both the P3 uh, and the P8 will be, uh, will be used uh, for the foreseeable.